Welcome back to our channel. Today we made fried fish cakes from fillet tilapia fish and fried stuffed bitter melon. Yay! Woohoo! First we need fillet tilapia. If you just buy from the store but don't have time to cook, put it straight into the freezer or cut it into small pieces. Marinate it and put it into the freezer. Two ways still count. Marinate one pound fish with one, one half tablespoon cornstarch, one half tablespoon canola, one tablespoon sugar, one fourth teaspoon baking powder, one fourth teaspoon black pepper. Put marinade fish into the freezer for at least two hours. Cut shallots and green onions. You could stuff fish paste into the bitter melon or many sweet peppers, or just fry it. It's up to you. Mom wants to cook bitter melon soup with dried shrimp so she sliced them into thin pieces. Now cut them for easy stuff. After two hours in the freezer, use food processor to blend the fish with the preparing onion. Fifteen seconds after every pulse, until it's all combined into a smooth paste. Smooth paste. So just pulse it. Ooh, wow, look at that. Wow, now we just need to stuff it into a bitter melon or sweet peppers, as you wish. As you wish. The leftover fish paste you could put into the piping bag for easier piping out when frying. Today, mom wants to use air fryer to fry the stuffed bitter melon. Using foil for easier cleaning is the tip. Spray the oil before and after adding bitter melon would keep them keep the frying stuff from drying. 350 Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. If you don't use air fryer, fry them on the hot oil pan. Use one fourth teaspoons of any flour you have to put into the hot oil would keep the oil from splashing. Cut the big hole of the piping bag. Pipe it into the hot oil pan. Use the scissors to cut the paste, not the bag, okay? <laughs> Always deep fry fish cakes with medium low heat. This heat will help the fish cakes become stringy and slightly chewy. Not flaky taste. Mm. Whoa! Now the air fryer done. A job. You could dip stuffed bitter melon and stuffed sweet peppers with sriracha and hoisin sauce. It's super yummy. or eat along with dill soup. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel. See you next time. Bye.